it definitely involves probably a draft essay before I go in, just so it looks like I'm not fishing for answers. So the best thing to do beforehand is always email them. Um, make your subject line really clear, um, detail the course code that you're in and what you're coming about. So for example, ENG 271 midterm essay. And then um, in that um, email, just detail what you want to come and talk to them about. So really briefly, this is my thesis statement. I'd like to come discuss it with you, and that way they're uh, prepared to talk to you as well. If you have more than a thesis statement, and if you have um, some resources to follow with it, it'd be nice to bring um, some points for the the um, for the conference or for the meeting. Um, but there are times too where you kind of just want to chat about what's going on in class, and for those kinds of things, if you're walking by in the department, just feel free to to stop in if they're they're willing to take a few minutes with you. Uh, again, that depends on the stage of the assignment that I'm on. For example, if I'm just starting and I ha haven't even picked the topic yet, then maybe I'll just go and discuss the topic with my professors and like, kind of have a chat about it, toss around some ideas. Um, on the other hand, if it's getting closer to the due date, for example, and I've already done a bit of research about it, then I w could talk to the professor about my research, for example. Um, and I guess that is kind of preparation for uh, the meeting with the professor. And yeah, if it's just a chat, for example, about grad school, then I wouldn't necessarily do any preparation for that. Um, I try I tried not to prepare too much, um, just because I want it to be more natural. And, and I think uh, preparation is more when you're fearful of the professor, but I've found that they're always actually very welcoming and very understanding. Um, at the same time, I don't just walk in blindly. I feel like I do think about um, the professor's time and the fact that often there are lineups sometimes when, when I'm going. And I think about what I'm going to the office hours for, what I need clarification on or need help on, and instead of just arriving and sitting down and then starting to chat that way. It was pretty informal once I'd go, like we'd chat for a little bit and then like we'd actually start talking about what it was, so I didn't really prepare beforehand. So I would definitely prepare beforehand. I, I would suggest if you're with a group of friends, make sure that you have the same question in mind and don't just go on a whim because going on a whim without knowing what you're doing really, it's it's really confusing and embarrassing, especially if you haven't really talked to the teacher that much. So I guess I would like, I would definitely go to the office hours more right before the final 